and welcome back folks welcome back to let's play fallout as you can see we leveled last time no that is not how we get to that screen that is how you get to that screen and this time we can pick another perk um okay i will read out the new perks like this one animal friend animals will not attack one of their friends Unless the animal is threatened or attacked first. Exactly what an animal is in this world is open to debate. Hmm. That's, that actually sounds quite interesting. Um, the problem is that I don't really understand what this is saying. So, for instance, I don't... Okay, what does the term that something is a friend of you... Um, so I will probably not pick this perk. Um, okay, awareness, uh, awareness we already know. Um, bonus hand-to-hand -hand damage is also, of course, also very good. Um, bonus movement is probably better. Hmm. Dodger. You are less likely to be hit in combat if you have this perk. Every level will add plus 5 to your armor class in addition to the AC bonus from any worn armor. That would be also quite interesting given the fact that, given the fact that um, we as a close range slash um, an energy weapon character are forced, at least at the moment, um, Um, to face a lot of enemies in close combat. Educated. Um, I think we know that perk already. Explorer. The mark of the explorer is to search out new and interesting locations. With this perk you will have a greater chance of finding special places or people. Since we already have a very high level of luck, it's probably not such a great perk to, ha to have. Um, fortune finder. You have the talent of finding money, or just tend to get lucky. You'll find additional bottle caps in random encounters in the wastelands. Again, since we have a lot of luck already, probably not the most interesting perk. Heave Ho. Each level of the Heave Ho perk will give you throw will give your thrown weapons an additional plus two strength. Okay, we don't use thrown weapons at all, so that is not interesting. More criticals. You are more likely to cause critical hits in combat if you have this perk. Each level of more criticals will give plus 5% to your critical chance. This is a good thing. Hmm. Interesting. Mutate. The radiation of the wastelands has changed you. One of your traits has mutated into something else. Oh. Now that's... Well, that's a fun perk. Um, I'm very tempted actually to, to take that just just to well get surprised. Um, hmm, I will think about that. Mysterious stranger will. We know this perk um, already. Quick pockets. Uh, we also know. Scrounger. I think that's new can find more ammo than the normal post holocaust survivor. This perk will double the amount of ammo found in random encounters. Okay. Not that interesting I would say. Snake eater. Hmm. Poison resistance. I think this perk we already know. Or do we? Okay, anyway. I'm still going to read that out. Um, snake eater. Yum. Tastes like chicken. You have gained an immunity to poison resulting in plus 25% to your poison resistance. Okay, Swift Learner, we do in fact know. Oh, I'm... Okay, this would probably just make sense. I mean, given the character that we are playing. Um, that's also... This is very useful. Being able to move around in combat is very, very useful. This might, this will, this is probably even more 
useful than this perk. Um, but I'm... I am tempted... Hmm... Hmm. I'm very tempted. I'm very tempted. I'm. You know what? I'm going for it. Uh. I don't want to lose a trade. Wait. Hmm. Hmm. You have more innate abilities and talents than most, so we. But you will start with. Um, hmm. Well, actually, maybe we actually do want to get rid of this perk, since. Hmm. It does plus four of melee damage, but minus thirty percent to criticals. Yeah, let's get rid of this, and we get ah. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I'm not, I'm not so satisfied with that choice after all. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe this would be interesting because I mean we we have wearing armor anyway, so hmm. But, but okay, what happens when I press cancel? Oh, um, I actually do not get to pick a perk at all. Okay, and that's not what I want to do. Um, okay, that. Hmm, so do, do I really want to use that? Hmm. That's... I must say that I'm... This is actually not... This is, isn't that interesting after all. I was expecting something funny, but... Hmm. Yeah, and then I will go to... Go for... I will take the damage, yeah. I mean, take the extra point of damage. Okay. okay, we will want to invest probably all of it in energy weapons because we, do, we just need to bump up that skill desperately. Um, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, so that sort of a bit senseless what I did there before. Okay. Oh we're yeah. still in combat mode. Um ha. Okay now we can just destroy all these bots. But at least if um Tishu doesn't decide To destroy everyone again. Here, I've I've now spent ten minutes um, just deciding, talking about perks and trying to decide which perk I'm taking. Um, yeah, but it's 
Okay, another disc that you can read. Um, you know, Pip Boy. We'll, read, we'll, we'll do that when we'll. Um, when we have left this uh, highly radiated facility. Um, so there is. <clears throat> There is um, a better kind of armor in here, um, the combat armor, and there in fact it is. Probably to ha yeah, we can't carry that. Um, luckily, we have our trusty companions, um, like Ian, which in fact, which is actually, which is actually one of our trusty companions. The only one beside dog meat. Um, that is really trustworthy. Okay, let's get rid of all the heavy items. Mm. Okay, let's get rid of this ammunition. I don't use the rifle either. Okay. Um, I can also get rid of my, um, my armor. I could give it to Ian, but I actually, yeah, I think that, um, companions are actually not able, um, to use um, other armor than the one that they are they come equipped with. Okay, can we now pick up? Yeah, can pick up the armor. And okay, I didn't pay attention to the armor class, but um, yeah, it's just better. I mean, just better armor. Um, we will be getting even better armor, in fact, which is. Then the final kind of armor that you will ever have, the power armor. The power armor is, um, however, an item which is a bit elusive. Um, yeah, we won't get that until a bit later. Okay, this is a something plasma down a superconducting barrel. Um, yeah, the text is, I can't scroll up there. Okay, it's a plasma rifle. Um, I think we've already seen one of them in action. Oh no. Oh, I thought... Uh, I thought that these... Some of these would be trapped in there. Um, there will... Oh. So many good items that... That I just can't take with me. I will take the energy cell um, and that because these I can't take that. Ian, would you please take these and this gun? Okay, uh, can I now take the ammunition? Yeah, we need uh, to make sure that we don't spend too long in this facility because, well, there is this radiation that is kind of ah a problem. Okay, we do want this gun, however. Um, we do want the chain gun. Okay, where is this buffoon? This human um, this living disaster tissue. There he is, okay. I need to dump some shit into you. Please take all my shit. Like this 
Okay, I probably need this Geiger counter to be fair. Uh, get. Let's see whether we can pick up um, the very, very awesome machine, the chain gun, I mean. Whether we can pick up the chain gun. Yes, haha. -ha. Oh. Oh. So many cool items that I probably cannot pick up. Okay. Um. I will at least take the grenades. I mean, ah, and another disc. Um, that I can't pick up. Um, we could of course come back here, but yeah, the radiation. So, can I drop? Okay, you can, you can carry that actually. That's quite surprising. Um, so I think, um, yeah, I will actually stop this video here and when we'll, when we'll come back, we will probably just leave this place and then figure out what all these discs contain that we just picked up and we will, um, be selling a lot of loot. So yeah, until next time folks, until then.